Load them on my back. And then just the classic Ipan Senagi. This one's very nice because you wrap it and then you trap the arm and then you're running it. So now from here, I have the split leg stance. I go forward and I rotate him over his arm. Trapping that leg. All right, guys. Ipan Senagi, drop Ipan Senagi in four different ways. Sambo, Judo, wrestling, and Jiu Jitsu, okay? They all kind of have their thing about it. And even within just the world of Judo, there's many, many variations of Ipon Senagi. Uh, let's just start off with the classic Ipon Senagi from Judo. Okay, Kyle Sui, right? I'm gonna open this, I'm gonna turn, tuck this elbow through, I'm gonna drop my hips, load them on my back, and then just the classic Ipon Senagi. There's the split stance variation, there's the drop Ipon Senagi variation, this is the classic Koga, where you go off the collar, okay? Generally speaking, he likes to go over, but he could be under as well, okay? Maybe chambers down, but who knows, all right? Now let's look at some other Ipon Senagis that are pretty cool. Wrestling, chest to chest, clamp, okay? What they like to do a lot of the times is they want to take an outside step, and they're going to bring this arm up, okay? And as opposed to bringing the crook of the elbow into the armpit, I'm going to wrap my shoulder underneath the armpit, and then I'm gonna turn big, and keep everything tight, and I'm gonna run it using my legs, okay? This one's nice because it's very, very tight. You okay, did I have with you? <laughs> this one's nice because it's very tight, and because of, there's no gi, right? You can't rely on pulling of the sleeve. So that's why I'm gonna go chest to chest, I'm gonna grab this tricep, and even this, it's just not enough, what's the word I'm looking for? Tightness? Kazushi. Mm, kind of, not really. <laughs> Leverage, mm, stickiness, I don't know, right? It's just not tight enough. Right? If I just go traditional, look, this may slide off. See how this may slide, especially with a sweaty body. Friction? Okay? Friction, yes, maybe. This one's very nice because you wrap it and then you trap the arm and then you're running it. I mean, it's pretty tight, right, Nick? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely felt that. <laughs> Big fan. All right, Sambo. I really, really like this one, and I used to incorporate it a lot from losing position, okay? From this position, oh shoot, I'm losing position. I reach up over to the bicep here, and I clamp this elbow towards the outside. Okay, so now, he doesn't control my head because there's space, and if I want to, look, I can use my head freely, okay? If, he, if I'm here, now from here, look, I can't turn my head, he might pull my head down, right? Ah, he's really free to move his elbow in all of his directions. So I'm gonna go inside, turn it so now i'm going to clamp it to my chest so now this is not as useful not a great position for me to be in still okay from this position i'm going to whip my leg around pendulum it do a regular drop sanagi like in judo but as i do so i'm going to go up and i'm going to wrap this leg with my right arm okay okay so now from here i have the split leg stance i go forward and i rotate him over his arm trapping that leg okay, it's a very sambalesque ipon sanagi Okay, very, very cool. It's a classic. I used to love doing this. You, Guys, won, a, would, yeah. you won a Sambo thing. I did win a Sambo thing back in the day. Yeah, Pan Ams. I went to the Sambo World. I pulled a six-time world champion from Russia. And listen to this. He submitted everyone. I scored one point on him. Was it from this? No, it was a regular high crotch. Oh, okay, nice. Yeah, it was pretty good, though. Yeah. It's enough for the W. Does that, yeah. does that <laughs> win, uh, win, win a match in Sambo? No, no. He, I mean, he like beat me pretty good. Uh, he like tech, it was like 10 to 1 or something. Oh. But I did, he came to the collar, I came here, boom, and I ran it, and then he went to his hands and knees. He turned to his hands and knees, boom, which is one point in Tambo. Uh, so I did get him there once. Wow. Yeah. And then he destroyed me after that. <laughs> Weren't you there for a judo tournament and then they were just like, you should enter the Sambo tournament? Is that, is that the story? No, no, not the world. Oh. You know, the US coach, US manager is a judo guy in Philadelphia who also runs the Sambo, USA. So he was like, yo, why don't you go to this thing? I was like, do I need to qualify? He goes, nah, man, just come with me. You're the best. <laughs> Thanks, Michael. <laughs> so, clamping on the end to the outside, I'm gonna turn the pong senagi, and I squat down here and I trap this leg. Okay, so now from here, I keep this elbow open, and I run it, and then rotate him over that leg, over that arm. Over that leg that I just trapped with my arm. Brazilian Jiu Jitsu does a drop Senagi. Yeah, they do a drop Senagi, but it's very unique, okay? Because their hips are so far back, okay? 
For me to turn and enter this space is very, very difficult. So a lot of guys opt to do a cross collar quarter turn drop Zainagi. Because if they drop all the way and they don't get it, they give it up their back. And even if I do get it and he goes over, and he throws the hooks in, I'm losing. Okay, there's no points for taking somebody down. There's only points for how you land and how you control the person after you get taken down. Okay? So the best drop in I for Brazilian Jiu Jitsu is the quarter turn drop, which only works in Brazilian Jiu Jitsu because this guy has his hips up so far back. I'm gonna drop and do a quarter turn and pull this way. That's literally it. It's not, <laughs> it's not very fancy. Won't work on good judo guys or sambo guys, but for the rule set of BJJ, it's low risk, right? And because the hips are far back, that's generally the go-to. I know I said Ipon Senai, that's not Ipon Senai. Just Seoi. Seoi drops Senai, same thing. Yeah. I do have an Ipon Senai course on the internet. Please check it out. Shuntariyashi.com. Give us your email address, my email guy. Sir. Lewis over there, thank you. Sign up and uh, link below this video. Yes, and then Greg Reagan on social media. Okay, Nick, thank you. Us. Us. Thank you very much. Thank you. Bye that much. Bye that.